Hey guys, today we're going to fix a problem that plagues a lot of second generation Mazda Miatas. I didn't know this problem was so prevalent until I asked on a Facebook group for advice on how I could fix this. And it turns out that a lot of people have this exact same issue. But I haven't been able to find any videos showing how to fix it. The problem is simply that when closed, the left side of the glove box droops, leaving an unsightly gap. So I'm going to set up my camera here and try to fix this problem from suggestions that were offered to me through this Facebook group. The first thing I'm going to do is to get under the glove box and remove three screws on this metal track. Now that this track is removed, I should be able to open up the glove box and unclamp it from the hinge. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is move this hole further back. This is the hole that the brass screw went through that actually held this metal support to this piece of the lower dash. These other two black screws that we removed just went into the plastic of the glove box. Okay, as you can see, I drilled a second hole there, and that's the new hole that the brass screw is going to go back into. I also grabbed myself some washers to be used as spacers for the brass screw. That's going to be necessary to get the right adjustment on the glove box. Now we're just going to put things back together in reverse order. Okay, with just a few minutes of work, this is what we are able to accomplish. Looks like a much better fit. So hopefully you find this video helpful, and hopefully that's a uh, permanent fix. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, I learned something after making this video, and that's that even if the glove box is in place as it was at the beginning of the video. You can still take it out without taking those screws out from the bottom. You just pull that clip off and then slide that out. And that actually reveals the brace that we were just working on. As you can see, the black plastic screws don't actually attach to the bottom of the glove box attached to either side of it. I hope you found this video helpful and I hope you're able to correct your sagging dash in your second generation Mazda Miata. Thanks for watching.